Hello everyone! So it's been a long time uh, since I last posted a video and uh, I had a move and uh, during isolation so um, moved into um, an apartment so I was uh, renting a house there for a while and then my lease was up and I found a new place. So um, I just came from a run so um, hence the red face even though my face is normally red anyways. Um, but yeah I love my new neighborhood. Uh, there's a flower park um, across the way and that's where I usually uh, I go for a walk or a run and so um, So yeah, I hope everyone's having a uh, You know an okay time during this uh, phase two, whatever don't really want to focus on that, but um, yeah, so um, You'll kind of see this See I've got just a couple more boxes that I need to throw out that I've unpacked and everything and uh, Yeah, I'll definitely give you guys a uh, new apartment tour here Um and uh, yeah, I'll be making some vlogs now and uh, settling in and just catching up on life. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go take a shower now. And uh, yeah, I got some lots of, uh, a lot of new things going on and updates and I'll update you guys on that. All right, see you soon. Alrighty, so this is my outfit for the day. I'm wearing a purple shirt, purple V-shirt from Amazon and then my jeans are from White House Black Market. They're the distressed jeans. I don't own a whole lot of distressed jeans um, but I've definitely been loving this one um, since uh, the isolation so didn't have to really get dressed up too much. All right and I um, also want to share with you um, probably more detail about my hair. I went ahead and did a major transformation on my hair um, it is now a brown instead of a black. I got rid of the black. And uh, my amazing co-worker over at the salon there, um, Robin, she transformed my hair from black all the way to my, uh, closer to my natural color. This is definitely probably a level lighter than my natural color because um, we had to bleach it. So, um, but yeah, I'll definitely be making somewhat of a video of my hair transformation as well and kind of like the reasons why I did it. Yeah, I was black, um, had black hair for about 20 years. So yeah, well, I gotta go pick up Cheyenne and I gotta go grocery shopping as well. So, um, yeah, this is, uh, my look for the day. Hi guys. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is, um, I went ahead and put a bunch of products in my hair. Since it was bleached, I definitely put some um, heat protectant. I put mousse for volume because I've got very thin hair. And then um, I also put some shine in there as well. So what I'm gonna do is blow dry it now and style it. So yeah, so that way you can see kind of what it looks like now after all the work and changes that it went through. All right. I'm loving this color and I definitely have to uh, tone it ever so often because then I'll get too um, bright again. And it'll also get too warm for me and I like having um, pretty much kind of like a medium, medium dark brown, more of a neutral color. Not extreme, not too cool, not too warm either because um, obviously I'm neutral. Um, skin toned, very pale, I'm more on the neutral side, so, um, so yeah, so yeah, the dark color, the, uh, the black color is gone, so, yep, and I'm just gonna curl it now. All right, I'm just getting set up here. Yeah, it's such a nice day here in Alaska, so I have the windows open in my entire apartment in every room to get some good flow. And I always get hot too when you're having to blow dry your hair too. So, just 
everything forward here, so. And this curling iron is um, an inch and a quarter. I want to make sure. I think it's an inch and a quarter, or is it just an inch? Oh, I forget. Feels a little too big than an inch, so I think it's an inch and a quarter. I'm just curling everything back. And I just want some loose waves. I'm actually growing my hair out too. Grow it out. Well, today is the 4th of July. So what is everyone up to today? Me, I'm just at home. Home alone. A lot of changes since the um, virus came a few months ago. And, uh, and I'm actually dating now. Um, gosh, I was about single for 14 months. Met someone late November. And of course, you know, just just friends, you know, built a good built a good friendship. Then when I got back from my trips, um yeah, he decided he wanted to be more than friends at the end of January. So I became a girlfriend again. So of course I was pretty scared and stuff, but um, yeah, I mean, he's definitely have become a best friend of mine. So um, great guy, great guy. So I'm kind of thinking um, it's going pretty well. It's going really well, actually. So we might even do a um, boyfriend tag. Um, I don't know, a couple of weeks, months, don't know yet. We're just kind of going with the flow. And uh, so, yeah. And my daughter, my daughter really, really likes him a lot. So they get along great. So um, that's important, you know, oh, for us single mamas, man. When you're, when you're, you know, back in the dating game, holy freaking cow, it's it's hard. It's really hard. So I'm glad I spent 14 months just healing and grieving um, my last uh, toxic relationship, and um, you know, even went to therapy, you know, just to help me out uh, and work on myself. And uh, we had to stand up for myself and a lot of just, a lot of empowerment, really. And um, yeah, and just making better choices in, you know, who I, who I date, who I spend my time with, who I give my heart to, who I give my soul to, my body to. Um, yeah. So, yep. Yeah, so basically, I, um, I got layers in there, too. And, uh, yeah, so this is my new hair. I love it. I love it. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Yeah, so, um, yeah, so this is it for the hair portion of this vlog. Um, I haven't vlogged or posted in so long, so I'm trying to get back into the habit of it. Um, yeah, so, um. Lots of new stuff going on. Let's see. Um, I think I'll be doing a... Uh, I definitely want to possibly introduce you guys to uh, Andy, my boyfriend, who I'm dating now since uh, late January. And uh, I also want to do some makeup tutorials. Um, I've got some new makeup that I want to try, new foundations, new makeup, 
new concealers, new blush, um, just a lot of refreshing stuff. So I uh, hope you guys are all doing well and uh, yeah, we shall see. Um, lots of new changes. Oh, and I also moved into a new apartment, so I'll be doing an apartment tour um, shortly as well. I'm definitely just getting back into the mode of things of filming again and new content and just getting inspired again because yeah it's definitely been um you know rough here and there with uh you know this isolation thing and as well as just you know everyone re businesses reopening the city reopening and then you've got phase two going on and you got the rise of you know more cases yada yada due to testing and whatever and people who didn't know whatever cool dude change is good Change is scary, but it's good. It's always something we can count on. <laughs> yep, right? Hello there, everybody. What a beautiful day it is Hello. today here in Alaska. And um, we're here at the park. Can I say hi? Yes, of course. And here's Cheyenne. She wants to say hello. Hello. Go this it's way, honey. Hello. Honey, it's this way. <laughs> you keep missing. It's here. She wants to say hi. And it's, it's really a beautiful sun. day. Yeah, it's a sunny yeah, it's day today. Sunny. Oh, we're going for a little walk here. All right. Yeah, because I don't so know. So here we are. Where Look how beautiful sun? it is. Yeah, is it on? And it's... So we've had kind of like a rainy weather and then the sun would come out for a while and then rain again. So it's kind of like on and off. But of course we have beautiful yeah. rainbows. Yeah. So yep, we're just going to enjoy a little walk here. Yeah. And enjoy our beautiful day. Wait, Cheyenne, you want to say anything else? Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna put this on um on Facebook? Yes, Facebook and YouTube. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful lilacs. Oh my gosh, I love these. The house that I grew up in in Anchorage had lilacs in the front yard, so yeah, when I buy a house in a couple years, I'm definitely going to plant these. A bunch of them. All different colors. I love lilacs. And roses, too. Wow. And here's a little gazebo. 